Hello, hello, and welcome back to another video. So we're gonna be talking about a selfie light. I would, I would say the name, but I cannot pronounce the name. I'm gonna put the link down below so you can try to say the name yourself. It starts with a Q and it has a bunch of letters in it and I cannot pronounce it. But anyways, this is one of the Amazon recommended, Amazon bestseller. It's, it's a highly five-starred, I think it's five-starred, highly four-starred um, product. It is a selfie light clip that clips directly onto your smartphone or your tablet or whatever device you want to illuminate. Um, maybe it's a makeup thing. I don't know. But anyways, it's a uh, rechargeable USB, -C, uh, USB, micro USB. I don't know. One of those micro USB. Um, so in this video, we're going to be doing a, a standard. This is what I, this is what I do now. Uh, unboxing. We're going to do a hands on. And then we're gonna do a full review. So let's take a look. Okay, let's just do a quick hands-on with this thing and first impressions. So um, I had to charge it up a little bit to get it going, but that looks like a really nice soft light, very bright. Um, it has a decent clip on it with a decent spring. Um, it has a rubber coating right here. Um, so it won't scratch your devices. That's kind of nice. Um, that's going to be one of my biggest questions going into this review is 
will this rubber activate my touch screen and start to mess up my phone while I'm trying to use it. So um, it's got a regular uh, USB, a micro USB outlet here. That's an indicator light and that is the multi-purpose uh, button. So it's a, it's, it does all the three levels of brightness. Um, it's got a good click to it. It's made out of relatively cheap but hard plastic, so I'm not mad at that. Um, the seam between the outer light and the, the base um, is decent. Um, so it feels like it's gonna last. And for the price, you, you really can't, uh, you can't beat it for the price. All right, so next up, full review. Okay, so these are just test clips I did where I turned the brightness all the way up and then turned the brightness off to show comparison. Um, I think it does a decent job of lighting up things other than your face, um, but I think it's primarily good for faces. Um, as you can see here with my baby boy. Um, and then the tomatoes, it, I really like this one. I like how it, um, it gives a little bit of a professional look to the shot. Um, so don't think that this light is only for faces. It definitely can work on other things, but you just have to test it out and find out because as we know with video recording and photography, lighting is everything. So let's go ahead and take a look at my salad that I was preparing last night. It's not the best looking salad. It's a little wilted, but nonetheless it worked. So um, you can see here, it does a very good job of lighting up the salad. So definitely not just for faces, it's for other things. All right, so this is the final thoughts on this selfie light. Um, right now, selfie light is off. I'm in my car, it's about 20 degrees, freezing. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and fire this beast on. This is kind of why I bought this light. There's one, two, and three. Okay, so I'm going to be looking over here because that's where the that's where the screen is. Um, but yeah, this light is phenomenal for your face um, and it works quite well to light up other things other than your face. So all in all, I think that this thing is phenomenal. I dropped it once onto some tile, did not break at all. Wouldn't really expect it to break, but didn't break. Um, for the price, you cannot beat this. This thing is phenomenal. It fits in your pocket, it fits in your coat pocket, fits in your, your, your purse, it'll fit in your backpack. This thing is amazing. It's got some powerful LEDs. I think it charged up in like less than 30 minutes. So this thing is grade A. Um, I'm always striving to get better lighting and better audio um, because I do shoot on a Note 10 Plus. I'm not shooting on a DSLR or mirrorless or anything like that. I'm literally shooting on my eight megapixel front facing camera right now as I record this video. Um, but one of the downsides of this is it does make your eyes go slightly blind, <laughs> which I think is probably more common uh, with a bunch of LEDs shooting straight at your face. I wish that the plastic around the LEDs, the cover. I wish it was a little bit stronger in terms of blocking the actual LED, individual LEDs from showing through. That is something that would probably mean you'd have to have it a little bit thicker and a different type of plastic, but that's basically the only caveat I have right now. Um, it charges up by micro USB, which is great because everyone has one of those cables lying around and it doesn't need fast charging, so you definitely have a bunch of those laying around if you're an Android user or anyone who buys Bluetooth speakers or Bluetooth headphones. Ooh, excuse me, because they love to give those out to everyone. Everyone's got one of those three inch, six inch, 10 inch uh, micro USB cables. Um, but yeah, so this is, this is definitely a must buy 
It's so cheap that you don't even have to worry about it. Um, it's durable and as you can see, it lights up the face great. All right, there you go. That's the selfie light. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely like and subscribe down below. And once again, I thank you so much for watching my videos and look forward to more coming up soon.